So the winner is Oh, it's something about you. I'm gonna break it down. They don't know your style. I'm gonna keep it real. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Terrica Janice. If you are new here, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But y'all, in today's video, I am coming with another hygiene haul because you guys seem to really, really love these videos. I really love doing them, and I love buying new products, even though I don't like spending the money. I do love when I get new hygiene products. It just makes me feel good. I I'd be so excited to get home and just get in the shower, y'all. I'm sure that some of you guys know that feeling. So yeah, y'all, we're gonna go a couple places. I plan on going to Ulta today just because I wanna go somewhere a little bit different because I'm always going to Target. I may also stop at TJ Maxx as well, but we will be hitting up Target today. Y'all know it would not be a hygiene haul if I did not stop at Target, so I will be doing that. Before we head out, I do want to give a huge shout out to Rose Forever for sponsoring today's video. They were nice enough to send me over these beautiful, beautiful roses, y'all. And if anybody knows me, anybody has watched my channel before, you know I love flowers. I love having it set up in my house, but I don't necessarily always love the fact that they die within two days okay so these roses actually last up to a year rose forever is actually a company that's based out of new york and they offer 100 percent natural fresh roses that last up to a year and their roses actually include roses from ecuador they're known to actually have some of the best most high quality roses. They don't use any chemicals or anything like that to preserve the roses. They actually use natural oils and the bouquets are handcrafted by some of the best artisans. So they're gonna last you a really, really long time. They do deliver worldwide. So you guys will be able to pick you up roses for yourself, for your loved one. Rose Forever was actually nice enough to give me a coupon code to share with you guys. Erica 20 for $20 off. I will leave it on the screen and also in the description box down below. So that way you can go ahead and pick you up some nice little roses that's gonna last you again thank you so much to rose forever for sponsoring today's video we are just gonna go ahead and head over to ulta let's go alrighty y'all so <clears throat> i just pulled up to ulta and i am smelling good honey so we about to see what they what we can find I haven't hygiene shopped in Ulta in a minute. So I'm excited to see what they have. Hopefully we can find some good stuff. Looks like we got some shea butter and almond oil. I wonder how this smells. I've never seen this before. We have that. We got, they got the whole line up. Oh my God. I didn't even know that they had um, bath soaks in melatonin. I may grab that actually. Let's see how much it is six dollars oh they have a body wash too y'all look at this the dr tales melatonin line is just amazing because it will definitely put you to sleep they have a couple different soaps and everything too i love 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 this manuka honey and yogurt by shea moisture so i actually may pick this up let's see how much the soaps are let's see manuka honey and yogurt bar soap it's six or 5.99 so i think i'm gonna pick this up i remember um seeing this when i came into ulta a while ago and somebody said it's just way too thick so i don't think i'm gonna get this but i do want to try some of the body washes so this is calming this is actually body wash and bubble bath they have a papaya one which is open but papaya brightening body wash a daily hydration body wash okay um relaxing body wash this one is the purifying and hydrating interesting let me see it has white tea and lemon balm and then they got a coconut a coconut and cactus wash bar soap that smells good oh my god that smells really really good should i get this we gonna see what this is getting I really specifically came in here for uh, the Tree Hut body scrub, so I'm gonna see if they have any, which it looks like they do. Oh my goodness, they have they have some Tree Hut scrubs that I do not have, so I am hella excited about this. We got the green tea, green tea, lavender. I have I never smelled any of these. Papaya Paradise. Okay, Ulta is coming through. Desert Haze. Um, I feel like I haven't seen this much variety and 
tree hut scrubs in a long time. They have six tree hut body scrubs that I've never tried. Check these out and see what it's given. Let's set y'all up. They are stocked. They are stocked. So this is the Desert Haze um, scrub. I'm gonna try this next. I'm gonna smell it. These are ten dollars and forty nine cents. So I think I'm probably just I'm probably just gonna stick to three of them. This one's all right, but it has like a faint type of smell. Um, so we are not gonna get that one. Sugared fancy. That one's all right. This one is a papaya paradise. I heard this one smells really really good. This is cute, but I'm not a huge fan of lavender. So I'm sure I wouldn't like this. I'm not even that one and it lemon I'm trying to sneak as much as that one smells like um, some type of like lemon cleaning supply and I'm not a huge fan of like anything lemon when it comes to cleaning supplies so I don't think I'm gonna get that so we have the um, green tea one so this one's supposed to purify and balance I love that one. I actually really, really love that one. I think I'm gonna pick this up. And it has shea butter, papaya extract, and pineapple enzymes. So this looks. Oh my god, I love that one. It smells like a um, like a pina colada type of smell. I feel like I don't know. That's how I feel about this one. So I think I'm gonna pick this one up. If you guys are looking for um, tree hut scrubs, I would definitely check out. Ulta because they are stocked up or at least in my area they are let's see what else they have oh I didn't even see this one okay so the strawberry uh, sugar scrub everybody has been raving about this how good it smells so I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and pick this one up too I'm gonna grab this because I've been looking for a little massager brush for my hair. So I think I'm gonna get this, it's only $7.99. This is supposed to really help stimulate your scalp and get the blood to flow in and promote hair growth. So I think I'm gonna grab this. Did y'all know Pacifica had deodorants? I've never seen these before. So odor fighting enzymes, it's aluminum free. Ooh, okay, Mega Bay also has a um, detoxifying underarm bar i think i'm gonna pick this up this is definitely something i would be interested in and it's only eight dollars so it's supposed to activate it has activated charcoal to detoxify your underarms and leave them soft and odorless so i'm definitely gonna pick this up so they do have some of the tree hut shave oils which i have been wanting to try when i previously came here they only had like one i think and it was this one and i didn't really like the scent of this so i think i'm gonna try I love the watermelon scent from Tree Hut, but I think I'm gonna go with this one. Just because it's different. This is the moisturizing shave oil in the tropical glow scent. And I do have the body scrub in this scent, so I think it'll go perfect with that. So I'm gonna pick this up. They also have it in the Moroccan Rose scent. And then they have a post shower smoothing mist. So it's supposed to help relieve itchy, dry skin and prevent ingrown hairs. I think I'm gonna get this too. This does sound interesting, but I think for now, I'm gonna stick with just the shave oil. But let me know if y'all tried this down below and what y'all think about it. Y'all, Ulta is gonna take all my money. I think I'm ready to get up out of here and go to um, the TJ Maxx and Target because Ulta is so fucking expensive. We did good today, I'm excited. Girl, you have a wonderful day. You too, take care. I am in TJ Maxx, Marshalls. I'm in Marshalls now. This is right next door to Ulta. I just wanted to hop in and see what they have, if they had anything new. This is just like way too cute to pass up. It's a shower cap and it has, I guess these are, what are these, leopards? Leopards or jaguars? I don't fucking know. But I'm gonna grab one of these as well. This is, how much is this? This is, $3.99, so I'm definitely gonna pick this up. Okay, they have this petty scrub. It's supposed to clean, exfoliate, moisturize, and then it's supposed to massage at the same time. I think I've been seeing something similar to this on YouTube, but I think the girls have been getting it from Ulta, and this is $3.99, so I think I'm actually gonna go ahead 
and pick this up. They also have this one. This one has shea butter and tea tree oil. This one's $3.49. I think I'm gonna get both of these. Lately, when I've been coming into Marshalls and TJ Maxx and stuff like that, I haven't really been finding anything. You know what I did not think about? Everybody is out, and this line is probably gonna be long, and I'm gonna be sad about it because I feel like I've found some really good stuff so far. Okay, so if the line is long and I find a few more good products, I'll wait, but if not, I'm putting this back. Putting the bag and coming back another day. I'm trying to peep, peep out this line to see what it's talking about. It's really looking like they have some of the same stuff. Dr. Bronner's has hand spray, so I'm guessing this is like hand sanitizer. Okay, that's cute. Peppermint sugar soap. So for face, body, hair, and hands. Hmm. I do love the peppermint by Dr. Bronner's, but I don't think I'm gonna get this. I think I'm just gonna, um, actually, it looks like they have the peppermint bar. They do, but it's, what is this? It's in a different language, it looks like, but it is, it is $3.79, and I think at Target it's like $4 and some change, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and just pick this up. excited because there are some products that I want to pick up. You know what? I wanted to get some of the Mighty Patches because I'm not sure if you guys can tell, but I have like a bump here, here, and here. Um, and I'm trying to get rid of them. I, I just always feel so, so comfortable vlogging at Target. You know what I'm saying? Maybe it's because it's bigger and it's more space versus like in Ulta. Like, Ulta's small. We know that. And they're... Uh, Hygiene section is pretty small too, so if everybody's trying to look at hygiene, it's just tough, you know? So, I am going to pick up some of these Mighty Patches I've been seeing all over YouTube, and they seem to really work. So I'm gonna try these out and see if this actually does work. These are $7, so I'm gonna pick these up. Oh, oh my goodness, look at this. Y'all, how cute is this packaging? This is hair dye. That's so cute. These companies and these brands, they definitely know how to get us young people because really, if you got good packaging, you in the game, you in the game. Okay, so Mighty Patches, I wonder what's the difference. So I've really only seen the red one, this one. So this one is a Your Blemish Hero. Oh, okay, so these are in the invisible one. I don't know, what what's the difference, y'all? Let me know down below. But it looks like they have a larger area that you want to treat. They got one for your nose, um, for your pores, to clean your pores out. This one is for dark spots. Okay. But while we're over here, they have the instant resurfacing mask. I think this is the one. Apparently, it's supposed to leave your skin looking really, really soft and silky. And it is $17.99. Should I get this, y'all? I'm going to put it in the basket, but I don't know if I'm going to get it. Native has skincare. They have this one, which is in the coconut and vanilla. So this one is a moisturizing facial cleanser. This is a drying serum, facial lotion. Okay, and then they also have it in this scent right here, which is citrus and bergamot. I don't think I've seen this before. I've seen it like on YouTube and stuff like that, but I haven't seen it in person. The Dr. Teal's Body Scrub. What do y'all think about these? because I definitely want to try it. You know what? I think somebody recommended this one to me. The Cannabis Stativa Hemp Seed. This is the Shea Sugar Scrub. So I think I'm going to get this. It's only $5.99. So I think it, it may be worth it. I'm going to try it out. I've seen this. I think this is their newest line. This is by Myel Organics. Um, so this is the anti-shedding conditioner. Ooh, I think I'm gonna get this because y'all know I struggle with shedding quite a bit. They also have this anti-shedding gel hair mask. They don't have any shampoo though. So they have a leave-in conditioner, conditioner, just regular conditioner, and then a mask. So I think I'm actually gonna get this entire line. You know what? 
I'm actually gonna pick this one up. This is the coconut and mimosa flower lotion and I absolutely have fell in love with the body wash to this. I'm not sure how moisturizing the lotion is so I definitely wanna try it out. It's $7.99 so I think we're gonna pick this up. So I am on the body wash aisle now. Oh my goodness, I didn't realize that Okay, Method has bar soap now, what? So this is the um, coconut and rice milk bar soap. And I wanna get the body wash to actually go with this, but I don't even see that they have it. So I think I'm just gonna pick this up. Love Beauty and Planet has some new body wash out. This is coconut water and vitamin C, so it's supposed to soften and brighten. Okay, and then they have a watermelon one. This one has hyaluronic acid in it. I honestly need some more of this body conditioner, y'all. When I tell you, I go through this so quick. It's my favorite, y'all. It's my favorite. If you have not tried this, please do. I will never stop talking about this because it's so good. It's that good. And then this is the KP Bump Eraser. This is $10 versus the um, one from First Aid Beauty. That's $30. So if you are looking for something that'll help with strawberry legs, this will help. I'm not sure how good it is compared to the uh, KP Bump Eraser, but this is the Body Love. This is definitely new, um, but they do have an acne wash, body wash. So if you have like more acne prone skin or like back acne and stuff like that, this will be perfect for that. It's a pretty big bottle too. So they have that one. They also have a uh, Radiance Renew. So I am finally back at the house. Okay, so we are just gonna hop right on into it. So as you guys seen, I went to Ulta, Marshalls, and Target. I'm gonna show you everything that I picked up. I think I found some really, really good, good stuff. If you have not hit that subscribe button already, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Uh, leave a comment down below and also give this video a big old thumbs up. But we are just gonna hop right on into it. So I'm just gonna go in order how I normally do. We are gonna start with Ulta and um i feel like i found some really really good stuff at ulta i don't know if it's just the season i don't know if they just restocked but they had like all the goods i did get this shampoo massage brush it's by the diane brand and um i've actually never seen this brand before but it's really just a massage brush so i'm excited i believe it was like seven dollars or whatever it's supposed to really give you a deep cleanse for your hair plus it massages it gets the blood to flow in and stuff like that so Hopefully it'll help promote hair growth. I did pick up this moisturizing shave oil. Everybody has been talking about the Tree Hut shave oils and I had yet to try them because I really didn't see one that I liked. And this is the Tropical Glow one. I do also have the Body Scrub and the Tropical Glow scent. And I absolutely love the scent of this. It's very much, it gives me very much summer, very much vacation. Summer is coming up, I think it'll be perfect for that. I did not get to smell it in the store, so I'm gonna smell it. It gives me more of a fresher scent than the actual scrub does. The scrub is more of like a tropical fruity type of smell. So I really love this. It's supposed to smooth skin and help protect against cuts. So yeah, y'all, make sure that you guys check out the Tree Hut Shave Oils. I've heard a lot of good stuff about them. I'll let you guys know what I personally think about it once I try it, but I picked her up. I did pick up a few Tree Hut body scrubs and y'all already know I'm excited because I've been trying to build my hygiene collection, but it's been so hard to find these different scrubs. So cute. Oh my God, y'all. I'm so excited that I was able to find this. These were $10 and you know what's so funny? Like I swear before the hype started, these scrubs was like $6, $5.99. <laughs> now they are double the price so yeah y'all it is what it is they're very good i definitely smell the the papaya in this i would say it definitely gives that papaya vibe it is more on the sweet side um but i do really really like it it just gives me kind of like a blend of different fresh fruit so i did also pick up the strawberry one i did not get to sm smell this in the store but i've been hearing a lot of really great things about it and everybody has been saying that it smells super super delicious so i wanted to pick it up for hydrated youthful looking skin this is how it looks it's just a like pink very light pink type of color Ooh, it gives me like a hint of like a perfume smell it doesn't really smell like strawberries to me but it does smell good i don't know maybe it's just maybe once i actually use it it'll start to smell like strawberries but it doesn't at all but it does smell good it has shea butter strawberry and um salicy salicy 
salicylic acid and something else, beta hydroxy. So yeah, pick that one up. The last tree hug scrub that I picked up was the green tea one. This is supposed to purify and balance your skin. So I'm so excited to try this. I did smell this in the store and I fell in love with it. It smells so, so good. It smells so clean and so fresh and honestly smells like some type of laundry detergent or like a dryer sheet. Matter of fact, that's that's more of what that this smells like, like a fresh, nice dryer sheet. So I picked up the Skin Renewal Recipe Bar Soap. It has vitamin C in it. It's for dry and stressed skin. This is the Manuka Honey and Yogurt Bar Soap by Shea Moisture. And I had to pick this up because you guys have heard me talk about the Manuka Honey and um, Yogurt hair mask and conditioner and shampoo. Love the whole entire line. It just has my curls popping. So I feel like this is really gonna bring moisture to my skin. I did also get another Shea Moisture soap. This one caught my eye just kind of based off of the way it looked. It's kind of like a translucent type of bar soap. It's supposed to quench and refresh your skin for dehydrated skin. So had to pick this up. This is how it looks. And I am excited to try this out for y'all and I'll let y'all know how it goes. This is the Mega Bay Space Bar and it's supposed to detoxify your underarms as glycolic acid and tea tree for a smooth, clean armpit. So let me know if you guys have tried this down below. So that's actually the last thing that I picked up from um, Ulta. We're gonna just move right on to Marshalls. The first thing that I picked up was these two petty foot scrubs. It cleans your feet, it exfoliates your feet, it moisturizes and massages it all at once. This was $3.99 and it's made with shea butter and tea tree. You can use it up to 20 times it looks like. So I'm gonna let you guys know how this goes. Then I got another one that does also have shea butter and tea tree in it as well. And then I did go ahead and pick this up. It's just a shower cap and it has like little um, cheetahs or, or, or jaguars. Y'all let me know, I don't know what these is. But I thought it was like really, really cute. It was $3.99. You really can never go wrong with getting a shower cap. You can never have too many of them. It has like a little scrunchie so it can it won't come off. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it has like a little non-slip band so it doesn't slip off of your head. The last thing that I picked up was just the Dr. Bronner's peppermint soap. Y'all, I use this for the my, my intimate areas and my butt. And when I tell you, it just, I don't know, it just gives you a really clean, fresh type of feeling. I don't know. That, that may just be me, but I really like this. Keep it moving. Um, I got, I got quite a bit of stuff from Target. So I'm going to go over that with y'all. So I'm going to just go ahead and start with like the hair care products that I got. So this is the Sea Moss blend by my L organic this is the anti-shedding curl pudding right here and i just thought this would be perfect because if you guys you guys have probably heard me say that my hair shed quite a bit so i really try to go towards anything that's going to help stop that or reduce it so this one is the curl pudding supposed to eliminate frizz and provide some shine to your hair as well i'll let you guys know how i feel if you have tried this let me know how it is i think they just recently came out with this so i got that from the same line i got the conditioner um and then i also got the uh, leave-in conditioner too so Real excited to try this and the packaging is so cute. I love it. Love it. I'm going to show you guys some other products that I picked up the other day by Myo Organics as well. I got the pomegranate and honey leave-in conditioner. It's really for more like thick curly hair, but even though my hair is more on the thinner side, I think it is still a really, really good conditioner. Uh, leave-in conditioner, I've actually tried it and it smells so, so good. Actually, anybody can use this, but if you have more of like thicker hair, this will be perfect because it has nice slip to it and it moisturizes your here um, and then I got the rosemary and mint strengthening shampoo as well again you know I'm here for anything that's gonna strengthen my hair and really you know lock in moisture and stuff like that so this shampoo y'all I actually tried it the other day last week actually I tried it and when I tell you it was so weird because typically when I use shampoo it doesn't feel like moisturizing when I tried this it was like moisturizing but it also felt my hair felt really clean as well so I don't know I really really love it it smells really good it does give like that really minty type of smell so I would check that out. Along with that, I did go ahead and pick up some of the scalp treatment as well, or scalp and hair treatment. So you can use this daily, you can use it as a scalp scalp treatment, or you can use it for your split ends. Um, so I went ahead and picked this up by my LL Organics as well. So that's pretty much all I got as far as like hair care goes. So I'm gonna just hop right into the rest of the things that I got. I picked up the rice milk, coconut, and shea butter method bar soap. 
did not know that method had bar soap so definitely had to try it out and i think it'll just go perfect with my rice milk body polish by dove i did also pick up these little mighty patches um apparently you're supposed to see results within you know overnight i was like let me go ahead and pick this up because like after i got back from my vacation I have a little bump here here and right here so i wanted to find something that's gonna quickly take care of that so we'll try these out and i'll let you know how it works i'm actually gonna put these on right after this video and i'm gonna let you guys know i did also pick up the love beauty and planet coconut milk and mimosa flower body lotion i did pick up the um body wash to this the haul before my last haul and I found it at Ross for $3.99. So I would check like Ross and stuff like that and Marshalls to see if you can find this first, but it does smell really, really good. So I've never, ever, ever tried the Dr. Teal's body scrub. So I definitely wanted to try this out. This is a cannabis sativa hemp seed oil body scrub, Shea Sugar body scrub. Somebody actually recommended this to me a while back and I had never seen it. So I was like, ooh, finally, let me go ahead and pick this up. I'm gonna try it out and let y'all know how it goes. If you have tried it, share it with us down below to let us know how it is. It smells really, really good, y'all. So this is how it looks. It gives that really fresh, clean, nice smell. I think we found some really, really good products today. So definitely leave a comment on what your favorite product is down below. Now we are gonna get into the good stuff. We are gonna get into what y'all really have been waiting on. I do wanna thank everybody who entered the giveaway and left a comment. We are gonna go ahead and pick the winner for the giveaway. I really do appreciate every single last one of you guys that left a comment down below. Watch the video. Um, I'm gonna actually have you guys reach out to me either on Instagram or like email or something like that. If you don't have an Instagram, you will have 24 hours to reach out to me so you can claim your $100 Target gift card. And I'll send that to you right away. Um, but yeah, y'all, so I'm going to just go ahead and pull up the little website that I use. Whoever the winner is, make sure that you hit me up on Instagram so I can send you your gift card. How do I even do this? Okay. Share. Oh, share. Okay. Copy link. All right. So I'm going to just go ahead and paste the video link into this comment picker right here. Let's paste it. Get comments. And then we are gonna start the random picker. So the winner is A, is that's her name on YouTube. And she said, I'd be scared to shop at Hawaii Target because I know they be taxing. Definitely, they were definitely taxing. And plus the taxes on top of that, it was just a mess. So A, you did win the $100 Target gift card. So make sure that you hit me up on Instagram so you can go ahead and get your gift card. You will have 24 hours from the time that this video is posted to reach out to me so that way I can give you your gift card. Um, but yeah, y'all, um, again, I really, 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 really appreciate you guys for getting me to actually 6,000 subscribers now. So let's just keep running it up, share with a friend, family member, you know, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, share with everybody. Again, more giveaways to come, so make sure that you guys stay tuned. That concludes today's video. Um, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to check out Rose Forever and use my coupon code TERRICA20. That'll be good for 30 days for y'all. Um, but until next time, I will see y'all in the next video. Peace.